Okay, I'm just going to give you a quick demonstration of how to um, get textures onto objects inside the Eden editor. If you want to put uh, different signs on different objects, works on pretty much any object. Um, some of them are designed to take textures, some of them are not. So for instance, this one here, anything that you've got that's got an M sign in it usually uh, is quite easy, doesn't need any scripting, um, anything that's not an actual sign. Uh, even a billboard uh, requires a little bit of scripting. So let's start off with uh, this one first. So you just take your object, go to the init, and then you put this code in there. Set object, texture global, and then this is the path to your image. Uh, what you need to do is give that object a name. So let's just call it billboard. Oops. number billboard one and then you take that name put it in front of your object or in front of your script and that is done so this code here is the location of that piece of media in your uh, mission folder okay and with this one it's even easier it's just quite like that. i'll just copy that from here actually because that's all we need for the uh, actual sign. So I'll just copy that. Go to the sign. And because it's a sign, right down at the bottom, you'll sign, find this object specific uh, texture. So then you can just drop the actual um, path to the image inside there. And there you go, it appears immediately. Uh, with the billboard, because it's scripted, it only actually appear once you um, play the scenario. And um, because you put in the set object global, uh, that object <coughs> will appear for all players. If you don't put global, if you just put set object, it will only appear for you. So you need to make sure you put use set object global. So return to Eden editor. So there. If it's designed, as I said, with a the texture, then you'll be able to see it during while you're doing your Eden editor stuff. If it's not, then you'll only be able to see it when you're in mission. Uh, so it's usually preferable to find something that you can actually uh, see while you're doing your mission. And where all of that goes is in your um, mission profile, where your mission SQM is. You just need to, this is the way that it's organized at the moment in the TFA training server, which is the one that I'm using. Um, so in the main mission folder, uh, you have a media folder. Inside that media folder, you have an images folder, and that's where all your images would go. Um, I've found had better results using JPGs than PNGs. Uh, that's why I usually load them up as JPGs. Just make sure you use small file sizes. You don't need anything too big to get a decent quality. And that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple, uh, pretty easy to do. Uh, once you've done it one or two times, it's very natural. And I will stick the code uh, into the description of this video so it's easy to just copy over.